Welcome back everybody to this new video to Express. Today I'm going to be showing you the very easy way how to make the connection between your chat EPT and truly design anything here into Canva. So the first thing to do, of course, the old workflow uh, often involves bouncing between different tools because using ChatGPT for ideas or copy, then switching to Canva to design, manually copying and pasting text, searching for images and hoping you stay on brand. Uh, basically, this fermentation includes friction and wasting your time. So the first thing to do is to clarify the plugin aspect. So while you might think of a traditional browser extension, this is an integration goes much deeper. That means that if you go, for example, into your extensions of Google Chrome or the browser that you're really using, you won't find uh, the extension of ChatGPT so you can use it uh, into Canva. Likewise, the third thing to do, of course, is to understand that there's a deep research connection. So this allows ChatGPT to access your existing Canva design documents, whiteboards, and presentations. There's an MCP model. That means that this is the magic that enables the AI to action on designs. It gives you AI assistance direct to access to your Canva workspaces, brand assets, and much more. Now, how we can connect ChatGPT to Canva? The first thing to do is to ensure that you have the right ChatGPT plan. You will need a subscription or part of the team earned price in order to make this successfully correct. Now, if I open my sidebar, I want to focus into the left section that says library. Into library, I want to look out, for example, for my GPTs, where I can explore all the topics for them. I'm going to type here the word Kemba. And here I have the effortlessly design anything, presentations, logo, there's the uh, Canva AI, there's Canva AI, Canvas, and so much more. But you wanted to focus into um, the option that says buy Canva because I wanted to look out for something that is totally reliable and in this case I want to be using that one. So here are some conversation starters that you can try them out. For example, how about an inspiration quote, graphic social media, make an Instagram post about breathing, breathtaking sounds, whatever. So I'm going to be using start chat. This will open a new section of the start. I'm going to close my sidebar. And then I wanted to look out for um, search, of course, for connecting my Canva account. When you use the Canva GPT for the first time, uh, it will prompt you to connect your Canva account. So you will be redirected to Canva's authorization page. You can log into the Canva account and grant the necessary permissions for the chat GPT and confirm the connection and start the prompting. Now here, I'm going to be going here for asked anything. So to get started here, this is where the magic happens. So let's say that I want to summarize the key uh, performance metrics from my, I'm going to be tapping in a specific report, or let's say I wanted to, let's say create a presentation. I'm going to be going for cancel, create a presentation about killer whales, generating some new designs. You can try using magic design, brand designs, design a simple poster, for example. Anytime you want to create something, it's going to be really important that you want to ask for what you're aiming for. For example, the word design is already understanding to create stuff, right? So I'm going to type design a simple event poster for a tech express AI work shop so then i can tell them exactly what am i actually looking for for example a modern minimalistic uh style including and lastly i'm gonna hit here for sending you can edit and adapt existing designs so when it says here send it directly it says talking to the connector what's going to happen here is going to be asking us to connect this plugin directly here for canva now if I open and it's half, what I'm going to do here is to open my Canva account. Once you are here into Canva, what you wanted to do is to sign in. You can create an account totally for free, you can just sign in. When you have your account already been created, you're already been signed in, right? Then I'm going to just leave this as it is. I'm going to head back to ChatGPT and hit for confirm. This will be sending, the, uh, let's prompt, for example, directly into Canva. So each time I, when I come back here, for example, what's going to happen here is that these ChatGPT plugin is going to be creating the modern minimalistic poster options. This is the technology, the AI improving. This is the report results. There's option number one and there's option number two. 
So you can try them out, you can figure out which one fits for you the best. And when this bold options are now correctly generated, what you're going to be doing here is to hit for generating some vicious for pure text prompts. Now, to truly become an AI designer maestro with this powerful integration, you can be specific and contextual. So would you like tips on how to customize this poster? Let's say don't, and I just click for option number two. This will open a new tab directly from Canva, and this exact design will be now being opened directly here into Canva. And I have TechPress, AI Workshop, Join Us, Innovate, whatever, whatever, whatever. Something else you can try out is to don't expect perfection in one go. Make it brighter, change the font, try an out layout. So treat ChatGPT as a design assistant. So really find your request is uh, something that you might want it to do. Understand the limitation, explore what ways, review the policies, and keep it human. So using the AI to eliminate tedious tasks and generate ideas, but always inject your unique creative flair and human touch into the final product and focus for a share, download, and you're good to go. So uh, there you have it, guys. Really, really easily how to use the integration between JGPT and Kimba is nothing short of revolutionary. It's no longer just about plugins. It's about seamless, intelligent workflow where your AI assistant can truly deep help you design um, anything. Right? So this video helped for you. Uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel, guys, for more actionable strategies on social media, productivity, and mastering the digital tools. Thank you guys so much for watching the video, and well, hopefully you can all see you next time.